Welcome to Planter Garden TV. How are you guys doing good today? Hope you guys doing awesome. I hope you guys had a good week. I hope you guys had a wonderful garden. Shout out to all the gardeners. Shout out to all, everyone. Shout out to the new gardeners. Shout out to... Just keep planting. Just keep planting. Keep producing. The more you plant, the more you learn. So today I'm going and do, I'm going and have some peppers. I have several different type of peppers. This pepper is banana pepper. And this one is jalapeno. So this is two different pepper I have in the same area. I usually try to plant different things together just to see what can happen. And I think it really works out well because I plant the banana pepper and I also plant the jalapeno pepper and I'm not gonna lie guys they did wonderful okay so over here we have jalapeno pepper here as well I'm just picking, okay, over here we have banana pepper again, there's a lot of pepper to harvest today guys, lots of pepper, okay, alright, so let me go around this side, with these peppers, you can use this pepper and you could make pepper sauce. You can do whatever you like, a matter of fact, with these pepper. These are very hot pepper. We also have the monkey pepper, which, oh my goodness, is unbelievable. The kind of heat that pepper push, it's unbelievable. The rye peppers, what I do with the rye peppers, I take the seeds from the rye peppers. Because when you're taking, when you're taking seed from a plant, you want to make sure that that plant is basically, that fruit is ripe. Because you want to make sure the seed is mature enough Before you pick the plant, before you pick it, you want to make sure the seed is macho. So when you know when the banana pepper is ripe, it kind of gives you this color. It didn't look too whitey. It gives you that yellowish color so you know it is ready. Guys, I believe if you grow in peppers, the peppers should produce, continue produce until the last frost. When that frost hit, I think you should have pepper still on the plant. Okay, because I believe 
your pepper tree should be pro keep producing keep producing continuously i don't believe pepper tree is supposed to give you two peppers and then that's it these pepper tree been producing for months now for a few months and they never stop These are some nice size jalapeno pepper right here. 